fifth guru gauri mala fifth guru those who take to the sanctuary of the lord king are saved those who entangled in the region of maya fall flat on their faces on the earth the great men after the study of shastras smritis and vedas have thus said without god's meditation there is no liberation nor has any one attained peace man may amass the wealth of three worlds yet his waves of greed do not end without god's devotional worship where can stableness be found the mortal only wanders about restlessly and endlessly man engages himself in many fascinating frolics still his passions are not fulfilled they burn and burn and are never satisfied without devotion to lord's name all other efforts are useless oh my friend chant the name of the lord this is the essence of perfect peace in the company of the holy birth and death are ended nanak is the dust of the feet of the humble gauri mala fifth guru who can help me understand my condition only the creator knows it this person does things in ignorance he does not chant in meditation and does not perform any deep self disciplined meditation in all 10 directions his mind wanders by what deeds can his mind be restrained man says i am the master of my mind body wealth and land i am theirs and they are mine in doubt and worldly attachments he sees nothing with these tethers his feet are tied up what work did this man do then when he had no existence when the soul immaculate formless lord was all alone he did all things by himself he who has created this world knows the mystery of his doings says nanak the lord himself is the doer the true guru has removed my doubts gauri mala fifth guru without devotion to god all other deeds are in vain the performance of the recitation penance self mortification and other rites in this world are all wasted and plundered one engaging in fasts daily ceremonies and restraints shall not obtain even a shell for performing these o oh brother hereafter the way is different these are of no avail there those who bathe at sacred shrines of pilgrimage and wander over the earth find no place of rest hereafter there these are of no use at all by these performances one only pleases other people reciting the four vedas from memory they do not obtain the lord's mansion hereafter those who do not understand the one pure name practices total nonsense after deep thinking nanak says he who lives in the devotion swims across the sea of life serve the guru meditate on the god's name and discard pride from your mind gauri mala fifth guru o lord i chant your name har 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 i cannot do anything by myself o master as you keep me so i remain what can man do what is he capable of doing what is in his hand of this poor creature o my perfect lord we follow the path along which you guide o benefactor of the whole universe o great giver grant me that i may enshrine love for your form nanak offers this prayer to the lord that he may chant the name of the lord ra gauri maj fifth guru the universal creator of all is the one and only god by the grace of the true guru he is realized o merciful to the humble and meek o dear lord king you have created millions of people and engaged them in your service you are the lover of your devotees as is your nature o lord so do you pervade all the places how shall i see my beloved by what good deeds shall i see him in life become the slave of the saints and serve at their feet i dedicate the soul i am a sacrifice sacrifice to them bowing low i fall at the feet of the lord 
the pandit the religious scholars study the holy scriptures of the vedas some renounce the world and bathe at sacred shrines of the pilgrimage some sing divine songs and melodies but i meditate on the name of the fearless lord my master has become merciful to me i was a sinner and i have become pure by falling at the feet of the guru dispelling my doubts and fears the guru has rid me of the hatred the guru has fulfilled my mind's desires he who has obtained the name is truly wealthy he who meditates on the lord is glorified whoever is in holy company of the sad sangat pure are all his deeds nanak the lord slave easily gets immersed in the lord gauri fifth guru maj come to me o my beloved lord night and day with each and every breath i think of you o holy one falling at your feet i pray i urge to give him this message without you how can i be saved in your company i enjoy ecstasy you are in the forest the fields and the three worlds and you spread peace and sublime and supreme bliss with you my bridal bed looks beautiful and myself blossoms in ecstasy by the blessed vision of your darshan i obtain such joy i wash your feet and ever serve you o divine lord i worship and adore you i bow down before you i am the slave of your slaves i chant your name i offer this prayer to you o my master my desire is fulfilled and my mind and body are in bloom at the blessed vision of the lord's darshan all my agonies are cast off by constantly uttering the name of the lord god i have been saved nanak endures this unendurable celestial bliss gauri maj fifth guru listen listen o my friend and companion o beloved of my mind my mind and body are yours this life is a sacrifice unto you may i never forget you o lord you are the support of my life forever i am in your eternal sanctuary meeting him my mind is revived o brother by guru's grace i have found the lord all things belong to god all places belong to god i am forever a sacrifice unto god very fortunate are those who meditate on this treasure of name they enshrine love for the name of the one immaculate lord finding the perfect guru all sufferings is dispelled day and night i sing the glories of the god your name is the treasure of jewels lord you are the true merchant your devotee is your trader true is the trade of those who have the wealth of the lord's wealth servant nanak is forever a sacrifice unto you rag gauri maj fifth guru the universal creator is the one and only god by the grace of the true guru he is realized o creator in you i take great pride through your almighty power i dwell in peace the true word of the shabad is my holy mark and insignia on me he hears and knows everything but he keeps silent bewitched by maya he never regains consciousness from the worldly valuables the riddles and hints are given and he sees them with his eyes but he is foolish and greedy and he never listens to what is said to him why bother to count one Two, three, and four. The whole world is defrauded by the same worldly players. There is hardly any lover of God's name, and rare is the place that is left in bloom with the Lord's name. Lord's devotees look beauteous at the true portal. Day and night they make merry. They who are imbued with the God's love, slave Nanak is sacrifice unto them. Gauri fifth Guru Maj. The destroyer of calamities is your name, O Lord. The destroyer of calamities is your name. Twenty-four hours meditate on the divine wisdom of the perfect true Guru. That heart in which the supreme Lord God abides is the most beautiful place. The messenger of death does not even approach those who chant the glorious praises of the Lord with their tongue. I have not understood the wisdom of the serving Him. nor have i worshiped him in meditation 
you are my support o life of the world o my master inaccessible and incomprehensible when the lord of the world becomes merciful sorrow and suffering departs even the hot wind does not touch the man whom the true guru himself shields the guru is omnipresent lord the guru the merciful master and guru the true creator when the guru is mightily pleased i attain everything servant nanak is ever a sacrifice unto the guru gauri maj fifth guru all pervading is the lord omnipresent god meditating on him all affairs are resolved by uttering the name of the world lord my tongue becomes pure one who recites to me god's praise is my brother and friend one in whom all treasures all rewards and all virtues are embodied why should we forget that one world lord from our mind by contemplating on whom all miseries depart grasping the hem of his robe we live and cross over the terrifying world ocean joining the company of the holy one is saved and one's face becomes radiant in the coat of the lord the praise of the sustainer of the universe is the essence of life and the wealth of his saints nanak is saved chanting the name of the lord in the true portal he is cheered and applauded gauri maj fifth guru sing the sweet praises of the lord o my soul sing the sweet praises of the lord imbued to the true one even the homeless find a home all other relishes are insipid with them the body and mind are rendered tasteless whoever passes life without god cursed is his existence grasping the hem of the robe of the holy saint we cross over the world ocean by worship of the supreme lord god all your family shall be saved he is a companion a relative and a good friend of mine who implants the lord's name within my heart he washes off all my demerits and is so generous to me wealth treasure and home are but just ruins the lord's feet are the only treasure nanak is the beggar standing at your door o god he begs for your charity the universal creator god is one and only by the grace of true guru he is realized rag gauri ninth guru o holy sadhus forsake the pride of your mind lust anger and company of evil people run away from them day and night he who considers both joy and sorrow honor and dishonor the same remains aloof from during circumstances of joy and sorrow and realizes the true essence of the world renounce both praise and blame and instead seek the status of nirvana o servant nanak this is such a difficult game only a few gurmukh through the guru's guidance understand it gauri ninth guru o holy sadhus the pervading lord designed this creation one person passes away and another thinks that he will live forever this is a wonder beyond understanding the mortal is in power of lust anger and worldly love and has forgotten the immortal form of the lord the body is unreal like a dream at night is transitory while man believes it to be real whatever is seen all that shall vanish like a shadow of a cloud o servant nanak one who knows the world to be unreal dwells in the sanctuary of the lord gauri ninth guru the praise of the lord does not come to dwell in the mind of the mortal day and night he remains engrossed in the love of maya tell me then how can he sing god's glories absorbed in his love for family friend wealth and maya the mortal ever binds himself with them like the deer's delusion this world is false yet on seeing it the mortal chases after the illusion our lord is the source of pleasures and liberation and yet the fool forgets him o servant nanak 
among million there is hardly any one who attains the lord's meditation gauri ninth guru o holy sadhus this mind cannot be restrained fickle desires dwell within it and it cannot remain steady the heart is filled with anger and violence which cause all finer senses to be forgotten this anger snatches away the jewel of divine knowledge from everyone nothing can withstand it the yogis have tried everything and failed the virtuous have grown weary of singing god's glories or servant nanak when the lord becomes merciful then every effort is successful gauri ninth guru o holy sadhus sing the glorious praises of the world master you have obtained the invaluable human life why waste it away in vain god is a purifier of the sinner and a relation of the meek enter thou his sanctuary he is the purifier of sinners the friend of humble come and enter the lord sanctuary why do you forget him by remembering whom even the mighty elephants fear was removed